Hi, my name is Amir Lugo Rodriguez, and I'm one of the assistants here for the women's volleyball program at UCLA. So I had a bit of a late start to volleyball. My first full year of volleyball high school and club was my senior year. Um, I was going to go play at a Division III school, Emanuel College in Boston, Massachusetts. I ended up uh, withdrawing from there and was all set to go to Irvine Valley College when I got offered a spot at uh, California Baptist University. I played there for two years and then ended up transferring to Long Beach State. Uh, I was there for three seasons, was lucky enough to go to two Final Fours, was an All-American, um, a team captain there, and around that time is actually when I met Alfie. Um, I was kind of like an arm or a practice player uh, in the USA gym for a little bit, and so that was my first connection with Alfie. Following graduating, I went to France and I played. Upon uh, returning, I was the director of ops for the men's team at Long Beach State when they won against a school I can't seem to remember um, in 2018. Following that, I was at the University of California, Berkeley for two seasons, and most recently at Northwestern for three seasons. So I've known Alfie for about seven or so years now. Um, we, I worked at the same club as him. Um, I used to hit down balls for him and, and wipe sweat and shag in the USA gym. And, you know, we have a lot of similar friends. So our paths, um, as he went from playing and then coaching out here in Southern California to the Big Ten and then San Diego, have continued to cross paths through mutual friends, um, volleyball, him always just being a resource who's so open to, to help and give advice. A couple years ago, I met Jen in Louisville where she was being kind of bullied for eating potato chips with ketchup. Personally, I think it's a great idea, but based off of the dynamic there, zero chance I was going to speak up. So after we were walking around recruiting, uh, definitely talked to her about that, and we, we've just become very good friends ever since then, and also somebody who I've bounced ideas off over the past couple of years. Um, you know, we've collaborated on scout, on training, and just developed a, an awesome friendship. So the whole staff here, it's been interesting. This is the first time I've worked somewhere where I'm integrating to working with my friends. And I think that's just created this seamless transition. Um, I think the girls also appreciate it. Our staff is always laughing, joking. Um, you know, we're serious when we need to be, but for the most part, everything here is so lighthearted, um, so willing to just help and have fun and really just enjoy our experience here at UCLA. Uh, I would describe my coaching style as very, very just calm. Outside of the gym, I'm very mellow. Um, in practice, in matches, pretty much the same. I would say one thing I've always been told is I'm very consistent. And so I've always found that the athletes um, benefit and appreciate someone who's, who's just very level-headed. And so the way that I'm talking now is very much similar to how I would be coaching some of our girls once we get into the gym. I love watching video. We're always looking at uh, the women's international game, the men's international game, uh, pulling things from college. And so I think the whole point of I'm just trying to educate and give resources and find as many different ways that we can accomplish and help certain athletes uh, attain the goals that they have set out for themselves. Favorite beach in LA area? Manhattan Beach. Um, favorite board short brand? That would have to be O'Neill. Um, favorite restaurant in LA? It's a tough one. I'll have to go with uh, my cousin's restaurant, La Serenata. Gotcha, okay. um, favorite thing to do outside of volleyball? Uh, I love reading. I love hiking and being outdoors uh, at all costs. It's something that I'm very happy to be back in California to have access to driving to the close states, uh, going back to Northern California, Central California, uh, anything outdoors. I really enjoy my time. Shoes or no shoes? Never, ever wear shoes. You're welcome, Des. <laughs> um, favorite karaoke song? I've actually never done karaoke, which is my fun fact, and I have a feeling with the staff that's probably going to change. 
Thanks for watching. Hopefully get to see everybody in Pauly at one of our matches. Go Bruins.